Hello everyone, so um, long story, there's a long story, but I'm gonna make it quick. So I, I tested someone and I did a 23ME kit and this is another journey I guess and I tested, guess who I tested? I tested uh, how would you how would I phrase this? So I tested someone. This is their DNA. This is their saliva. That is their DNA right there. Um it's already sealed. I brought it from the airport. I um am, okay, so the the term is Okay, there it's either English and Spanish. The term is pure Indian, no pure, pure indigenous, or in Spanish it's um either. I know it. It's written down. Okay, it's a. It's um. What's the word? Indígena. Hmm. Is it? I I I don't know. I don't have paper right now. It's right there. I don't want to walk to it. But it's pure indigenous, it translates, um, I tested a pure indigenous American um, from Mexico, I'm not going to say where. And this person spoke a indigenous language, I'm not going to say what indigenous language, but um, I only took one DNA test kit with me. And I managed to get their, I managed to get their DNA. Um, I don't want to show my password okay but here it is it is full um the back is it has the air in it so it's like hmm, it's like it's big so I, I can't really put it in a package it won't close because i just i i was so nervous about it that i i just i got from i got home from the airport yesterday and i just i was talking and i was closing and taking out the tape and i let out a lot of air in so now the box is enclosed and I was like, I just worry that everything was going to mess up. I was worried that they were going to throw a DNA test kit in the airport, but they didn't. Um, this is how it looks when I put it in. It's kind of hard. It doesn't really close. I don't want the back to rip. I don't know. Anyways, um, this is a lot of rambling, but um, so yeah, as I said, I went on a long trip. Um, I test. I got their birth. I got a birth certificate, and in the birth certificate, it says pure Indian, and it says okay. It says pure Indian. Um, they speak a native language. This person speaks a native language, indigenous language, whatever you want to call it. Um, this person is indigenous. Um, so I just like, hey, can I take a DNA test kit? They're like, yeah, you know, like. Um, I took a little paper for translation, like in Spanish. I took a translation paper because Twenty Me used to provide a a paper where it was it would translate to many languages, and I took it and whatever they did some translating for me, and I got DNA. So I will ship it today on Monday. Monday, today's Monday, September twenty second, two thousand fourteen, and hopefully I get the results within at least four weeks. Um, I'm nervous. I'm nervous to ship it. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen. Hopefully, I did it right. Hopefully, it didn't mess up. Hopefully, everything's good. And yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, <laughs> is something gonna go wrong? I don't know. But um, hopefully, nothing goes wrong. I am excited for the results. I will hopefully share the results with y'all. Um, what I was like, yeah, I mean, I could have tested a lot of indigenous people, um, over there. Okay, so, um, yeah, like, honestly, like, I could have tested so many indigenous people over there, you know, because, um, in Mexico, there's a lot, well, not everywhere, like, if you go to the city, you're gonna I don't mean I don't mean to like stereotype but if you're gonna find an Indian in the city it's probably gonna be selling on the street you know because I went to um, 
I went to Mexico, some part of Mexico, and I saw some girl, some like young girl, speaking like she was like blah 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 blah, blah. and then I just kept looking at her. I just kept looking at her, and and then um, I was like, what? She's not speaking Spanish. I was talking to some people. I was like, she's not speaking Spanish. She's not speaking Spanish. And then we we're, we're looking at her, and I'm looking at her, and then she's looking at us. And we tell, and her grandma, I think it was her grandma, was selling like fruits or stuff to sell that they made. And we asked her, like, um, you're not speaking Spanish. We asked her in Spanish, um, you're not speaking Spanish. What are you speaking? She's like, Sapo meets tech or something like that. Apple tech, something with tech. I don't know. It's like T E C tech. She's like, Miss tech. And I was like, oh, okay. And other than that, um, I went through a lot of like really, really small towns in the middle of nowhere. And a lot of these towns have like Indian names, like um, Indian names and Indian like, things, I guess. Like um, if you go to certain places, it's not going to have an Indian name. Like if it's named... San Juan, San Pablo, whatever, it's like, it's not really Indian, like, so, I went to some place that were, like, fucking weird, had weird names, like, ma 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 blah, 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 I don't know, I had a lot of L's, um, a lot of X's, a lot of H's, and, yeah, that's how I knew I was in, in like, around Indian towns, either way, if, like um, the government put signs that you're going into an Indian town, and they call it the Indigena, Indigena something. It had a big billboard like uh, how they spend the money, I guess, or something like that the population. <clears throat> so yeah, I went through a lot of Indian towns, and uh, a lot of them had different type of clothing. It was it was a long trip. It was a lot to explain, but I will ship this DNA Tisca today, right now. It's barely like 10, 10 30. I'm good, and yeah, I will share the results. So, if anyone's interested, like, I will share the whole results. Like, um, I also try to share the birth certificate, but it's like, um, I have to edit, blur everything out, all the information. But on the birth certificate, it says, like, it's um, I think it said Indigena Pura, or is it? Es de indígena, es de raza indígena, es pura indi, es indígena, de raza indígena pura, pure, in, yeah, because it's, it's indígena pura, pure, something like that, indígena pura, because when you translate it, it's just pure indigenous, so I, it might say indigen, indígena pura, pura, I don't know, it says, it says mom and dad are pure indigenous, they do not know how to write. They do not know how to. They do not know how to write or speak, and they are of indigenous, of pure indigenous race. That's what I said. I will try to share that with y'all. Cause honestly, I've never seen like um, a birth certificate like that. This is like a ancient, not an ancient. It's like an old birth certificate, because um, it's very long. Well, I don't know if it's a birth certificate. It's something, it's a document. But I got a copy, I got a lot of copies. And yeah, I mean, I wish I could have taken more DNA test kits. So I could have taken test a lot of Indians because I went to a lot of Indian towns. And let me tell you, it did not cost me anything to t test, test an Indian from Mexico. It didn't cost me a cent. You know, obviously it cost me to pay for the test you know I pay for this test for myself I pay with my own money and it didn't it didn't charge me anything but um, you know if 23 and me wanted to test more Indians like pay them off you know what I mean like give them money go to okay because I went to all the pyramids I went to most pyramids and when you go to most pyramids all around there there's Indians so I went to a lot of pyramids on my vacation and let me tell you, a lot of these people want money, and if you give them five dollars, ten dollars, which is a hundred pesos, 
they'll like they'll be gladly to take a DNA test kit for you. You know, they'll be like, yeah, give me a hundred pesos and I'll take a DNA test kit for you. And these people, um, you know, they're Indians because they speak um, their own language. Like um, they don't make it up. You know what I mean? Like, and a lot of these people, like um, they speak their own language and. Uh, I think Icha, which is I H I C A H Icha, something about international whatever of history of Mexico. Um, either I don't know how they do it, but there's a lot of like these Indians selling their stuff around there or in there, and I recorded some on video, and they're speaking their own language I don't know which way it is there's I mean every pyramid you go there's different types of Indians speaking different types of languages and yeah like they were speaking in their own language they're like oh I told this lady um, yeah I'll record you that way I get more tourism to, because like fuck those pyramids were empty like you could have done a lot of shit like in the pyramids because I like there's not enough tourism there and I understand why there's not enough tourism. It is, oh, yeah. But um, they're very cool. You know what I mean? Like, they just <laughs> like uh, most people want to sell their stuff and they want money and yeah. Like, if I would have taken a DNA test kit, a bunch, I would have tested them. You know, they would have for a hundred pesos, which is like ten dollars. They would have. They would have um, been like, hell yeah, give me them 10 pesos. You know, I could buy something for, or like $20, 200 pesos. I was there. They would have been gladly to take it there. I'm like, yeah, I could buy myself something good today. It's like, all you want is spit? Yeah, it's spit. It's like, I produce that to that a lot. That's for 20 pesos. Yeah, go ahead. I'll take my spit. <laughs> but yeah, um, I, that's what I hate about it, that I didn't take enough DNA test kits with me. But it was cool because, uh, um, yeah, it was cool learning all that. That's a different type of video. And look, I got a sunburn. I didn't get sunburn. I got my natural skin color. If you could tell, like, I'm really dark here, like, from my arms. And, like, if you look, like, I'm a different color. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, I'm, like, um, not burned here. I need to, it's because I need to go get a tan. I need to go to the nude beach. But, um, yeah, like, um, If anyone like is interesting in testing um, Indians, like um, go to Mexico and you'll get a lot of Indians. You know, for money, you could get a, you could test them like that. Um, anywhere in the Americas where like there's pyramids and you see someone speaking and you take a test and, and you pay them, they will like they will take it. You know what I mean? They will be like, yeah, I'll take it. Because um, there's more um, the the Indian the Indian population in 23 me is very small. I don't know what percentage it is, but um, they consider like North and South Amer North Americans and South Americans together in one group, making them Native American. But every group is different. So I want everyone to contribute to the to the Native American um, groups, so it goes higher, and so the results are more conclusive, and yeah, I mean, if, uh, you know, because Native Americans, I mean, like, um, Indians from Mexico are not gonna buy tests, they don't have the money, they don't understand that, so obviously, if you wanna help out, then buy a test, and you test them out, you know. I put the, I put this one in my luggage and my where they ship it down there. I didn't see it at all. I just put it in my luggage, took it to them, and I saw it in the border. I mean, I saw it when I got in the plane, and I just took it. I took it in my room. It's like, oh yeah, so there they approved it. I got home, I opened it, and it was approved. I just left it in my luggage the whole time, and my, the one I don't carry on, the one that goes in the plane, under the plane, whatever, and it, I made, I made it safe. So hopefully everything goes save and i will share the results and that's it because it's already been almost 15 minutes so yeah you could take this test anywhere 
on a plane it's safe um i get scared sometimes because i don't think it's good i don't make it but hopefully everything go works out because maybe it was exposed to too much heat temperature maybe it was too cold i don't know it's it's like it's traumatizing like not knowing whether um it's gonna work or not you know it's like oh my god like yeah but it should work i don't know like let's hope it works everyone um if it works i will share i will give updates about this later in the future maybe in four weeks when i get my results okay thank you that's it for watching Goodbye.